have a winner on that day is, is pretty good. And, and uh, look, I suppose it says it in the name of the race. It's the King's Cup. And I think it's, it's something that's starting to grow on the locals. It's a massive day's racing. And uh, it's the last big race of the season that they have here before it gets too hot. So yeah, it's always nice to go out on a high on a big winner. It's now uh, internationally recognised as a listed race, which is good for Bahrain uh, racing. It's open then for international horses to come in. And so you know, you're looking at horses that are rate or 100 or above. So, you know, it just goes to show you the level of horse that you need to have. And it probably helps to make the local trainers then up their game. Hopefully that seems that uh, His Highness Sheikh Sultan will up his game and, and start bringing in more horses and better horses that we can be as competitive as, as we have been for the last uh, year and a bit. So, yeah, look, um, we still have Zagato. He's coming in again this year and uh, he's the winner of it last year. Uh, I feel like he's at the same level. He is, uh, he's been primed for this race. He, he didn't start till a bit later. Um, and I feel like um, after his last run, running second in the Crown Prince Cup, I think he's uh, peaking at the right time. Zagato, the winner of the King's Cup. It's always a very difficult decision when you have, you know, the likes of the Kovex kid and Encourage, and I've moved multiple races on both of them. Look, it's, it's not an easy decision, but there are horses that I've been riding. I ride out every morning, uh, five days a week. So I get to sit on these horses and I get to see them very close up. And the good thing about it, the thing I like about it is that it's, it's my decision. His Highness Sheikh Sultan leaves it solely to me. So when, whether it's the right or the wrong decision, I'll always stand by that. If I make the right decision, it's brilliant because it's for me and it's for the Al Muhammadiyah team. But if I get swayed in any way to make the wrong decision and I don't go with my gut instinct, then I will feel a lot more worse. So, you know, if I'm on the right one, I'm on the right one. If I'm on the wrong one and Al Muhammadiyah Racing win it, then I'm still very much happy for the team. So, you know, I, I'm able to accept it in that respect. But I just feel this year that Zagato, not because he won the race last year, I feel that he's, he's held the same level this year and he's going into it after having a few runs and I feel like he's just, just peaking at the right time and his last piece of work, I rode him and I rode the Kovix kids separately. They both worked very well, but I just feel Zagato kind of just has that necklace, next level of class and um, you know, I hope I'm right.